Yeah. Use hang up more wire, please. It's, it's, it's basic it's like carpet. carpet. It's like carpet film. So when like people that do carpet go to in your house or just you have anybody doing work in your house, you lay this stuff down on your carpet so it doesn't make it dirty. And I looked up how to tape tires off. And that's what I found was going to work. Because I would have been here all day if I would have to take these off and say masking tape. <coughs> that could be the thumbnail, Tony. All we need is your hand on your hip. <laughs> Matt, here's a thumbnail. I am now. I missed that conversation. Okay. <laughs> Unfortunately. I think that'll be wasteful. I think that'll be good right there. Thanks, so too. What do they call it when you put that in your, like this? Tony, come on. They call that a food catcher. A, a food catcher, that's right. <laughs>
tractor wheels today with uh, John Deere primer. And uh, yeah, front and back wheels we're gonna prime. I'm mixing a 10 to 1 ratio, that's what John Deere recommends. So I'm gonna use about 24 ounces, so that'll be about 2.4 ish ounces of paint thinner and the rest paint.
guys. Okay, I just finished up painting the wheels and some of the wheel brackets. Come check it out. I think I got a real nice coat on here. The prep work was really good. And uh, come, come take a look at that finish. Look at that. There's no sags. Look at the gloss on that. Look at the depth. That's nice depth. That's what you want to see with no sags. Come take a look at these others. It's the big boy. I think they turned out really nice. Good depth. That's what you want without sags. This one's finishing up. As you can see, it's starting to become flat. And, uh, well, thanks for stopping in.